Welcome back to another episode of TBH. I'm your host, Jay from TheBeerHeads.com. Let's get into today's review. We're going to the Boston Beer Company. That's right, Samuel Adams out of Boston, Massachusetts. We're going to be reviewing one of their latest releases from their Barrel Room Collection. It is a Stony Brook Red. It is a Belgian-style Flemish Red Ale. They're basically using a, using their own type of yeast strain, bacteria strain. They're calling it KMF, Cosmic Mother Funker. Uh, basically, that is just their um, yeast strain with bacteria. They, they, they're basically replicating for a Belgian yeast strain, you guys. 9% ABV. Let's get this into a glass and I'll let you know what I think of it. Alright, now the appearance on the Stony Brook Red. You're definitely getting that dark, you know, bright red, Flemish red style uh, body and appearance. Nice amount of carbonation on this one, you guys. One finger to two finger of a frothy, just off-white khaki head. Uh, you're definitely getting some nice alcohol leggings on this one sticking to the glass. Very nice in appearance. That nice cloud haze sticking to the glass as well. Nice little, you know, chill uh, serving temperature for this one. You're definitely getting a hazy appearance as well, you guys. Wow, I didn't think Samuel Adams can do this one, you guys, but they hit this on the spot. You're getting that huge Flemish red, you know, quality of the nose. You're definitely getting those dark raspberry, blueberry qualities. You know, you definitely pick up some, you know, plum in there, some creek cherry almost. You get that nice acidic quality in the nose of this sourness and the floating and that aromatic quality in here. Some vinegar, that nice little funk quality. A little sweet malt backbone, but at the same time, just huge acidity nose just popping in the nose. Alright, cheers, you guys. A little different. The quality in the nose, you didn't really pick up too much alcohol. I say quality overpowered it, but on the palate, it's definitely more noticeable. In front of the palate, you get a raw, you know, earthy core of a of a cherry in there, like a raw cherry gone bad, but that nice creek quality to it, and you start picking up a little acidic qualities, a little tartness, not too overbearing acidic qualities on the palate where it's going to be too sour. You get a nice malty character little sweetness but at the same time you can definitely taste that alcohol on the palate you get a little heat to the chest not too much um, but you can definitely taste it it's more uh, you know lighter but at the same time more alcohol body to it you definitely get that more spirity quality of a body one like invinius too as well um, it's definitely a nice one you get those raspberries sweet blueberry juice in there it's definitely nice. It's not your typical Flemish red though, your Belgian Flemish red where it's over the body is going to be heavily carbonated as well. There's not too much carbonation. It is carbonated, but there's not too much. And it's not fuller in body. It's more light body to medium body. And it's a little bit uh, lighter. It's not as heavy. It almost has a nice sherry um, vibe going on as well, you guys. You also pick in some oak qualities in here. Very subtle. And they do age it in uh, oak brandy barrels. I forgot to mention that. And you do get that, like I said, that spirit body, that alcohol, that boozeness. And that's coming from that brandy barrel. It's definitely nice. You can also pick up a little sweet character, um, raisin, a little plum in there as well. You're definitely getting some uh, vanilla type vibe going on, a little toastiness. And that's all playing a part from that uh, oak barrel. Alright, so the verdict. On the Stony Brook Red, the Belgian style Flemish Red from the Samuel Adams Barrel Room Collection. 9% ABV, resale price for $8.99. 
um, out now, you guys. Pick it up if you can. Um, this one, you know what? I'm going to be giving it a, a 17 out of 20, making this a B-plus beer, borderline A-. minus. Um, I definitely see this one aging. It's worth aging. That alcohol is going to die down a little bit, more of a lesser alcohol body to the palate feel. Um, it's definitely going to be, you know, a good one to age. I definitely see this one, you know, getting a little bit more funky acidic qualities and bringing out less alcohol in the palate. It's definitely going to be a good one. I definitely say check this out. It's worth checking out. For a, an American brewer doing a Belgian style Flemish red, you know, they kind of almost hit it. It's not going to be too acidic like you would say, you know, La Folie from a new Belgian brewing company. Um, but it is its own little take on what they're doing for it. And it's it's pretty nice. It's definitely one I would say pick up and try it out. Other than that, you guys, it's been another great beer review. Like I always say, live, learn, and drink. Until next time, I'm going to enjoy my beer. You guys should do the same.